so what happens in picture in picture mode there will be two window one will be for the robot machine and one will be your main window so both users can work simultaneously and that will be an isolated window either you can take the control of that window or maybe you can completely work in the isolation so let me click on run in pip and let's see what happens this time now you can see one window pops up, which is a duplicate of your own machine, you can see. And then you will see two controls, take control and keep on top. We will see that also. So currently it is logging into the, the isolated window where the robot will be working, right? So there you go. The window has opened and let me parallelly work and do something on my system. And this is where the robot will be working and this is where I'll be working. So you can see, right? And let me go to format and do just anything. Meanwhile, this window is completely for the robot while I can make use of my main window, right? And uh, so I have opened and let me change the font to 28. Okay, so you can see this particular error coming up, start process in session time out, right? So why this particular error comes is because uh, there is a defined, uh, you know, the time limit for the picture in picture mode to start, right? So if you go and see uh, into the documentation, Right. So if you go and see into the documentation, it will say the default timeout to start a process in picture in picture mode is only 60 seconds. If the login in the picture in picture takes more than that, then a timeout error will be thrown. Right. So how to overcome this particular error? Let's just see that too. So what you have to do is add this particular environment variable in uh, this particular, you know, yeah, this particular parameter in your environment variable. So let's just go to the start and say environment variable. So edit the system environment variable, choose this particular option. And then you can see environment variables, right? And there are all your variables, right? So click on new and add this particular variable name. You can see you have path session timeout, just copy from here and paste it here. The variable value currently it is 60 seconds. So why don't we extend it to say 240 so that it is never timeout. So press OK and then click on OK button, right? And click on OK. Now you can see it's because of my system was too slow because I have so many applications installed in my system and the system is too slow. It is not because of the internet connectivity. Uh, make sure this in mind that it is not related to the internet connectivity. It is because your system is slow, right? So there we go. I have increased the timeout limit 